Ownership means independence for me because if you are able to own something, it means that you have responsibility. What's up, guys? Hey, explorers. My name is Tumi, Tumi Sibohudi, born and bred in Northwest, lived in Joburg, and now I'm based in Centurion. I'm actually based everywhere because I'm a global citizen. Yeah, just had to put that one out there. <laughs> I'm very passionate about traveling and for me traveling is not all about like moving from one place to another, it's about getting to your destination and exploring whatever that's there, mingling with people on the ground and doing experiences that are not, you know, done every day. So that's traveling for me. I started intentionally traveling in 2020 when I moved to, from Northwest to Johannesburg. I came here with a goal and it was for me to explore the whole of South Africa. Lucky enough, I got along with a lot of friends and most of them were not from the province that I was from. So it was an advantage for me and I did use that to my advantage. My, the first province that I traveled to was uh, Mpumalanga, very beautiful. It was during the World Cup and fast forward to 2020, last year during the peak of COVID, I thought you know what, it's about time I actually invite other people to explore. I was already getting, you know, queries and requests about how can I explore with Dumi? Because I had already launched the hashtag, hashtag explore with Dumi. I was using the hashtag to deliberately measure the people that I interact with online and the people that actually follow the traveling and the exploring that I do. So I'm from a very dynamic and diverse family that's also very curious. It's a pity that my parents were good travelers when we were growing up and now they stopped. And that's actually one of the things that I'm like, kind of like trying to recall cages when coming to that because I'm asking them a question, why did you stop when we grew up? Why, why don't we travel anymore as a family? And I guess the answer will always be that, you know, they are grown. They are retired right now and they don't want to be traveling long distances, hence they did it at a younger age. Africa is the future because this is where our ancestors are born. The beautiful land where our ancestors are born. They'd be really proud for us to take care of the land and actually invite the whole world to come see the beauty of what they've left behind. <laughs> 